there folks, I'm Dan Brown from sortofinteresting.com and today we're going to take a look at some small binoculars. Now I've been carrying these with me practically everywhere for the last couple of weeks and I've been fascinated at the random sightings of nature that I've had with them and for only around £10 I've got to say that they are excellent value for money from the benefit they give you for seeing wild. This particular pair is the Highlander 8x21 set and as you can see they are incredibly small which makes them absolutely perfect to just throw in your bag or in my case clip onto me belt and then get on me bike and run off into the wild have them at a moment's notice and as well as the small size they've also got a very low weight about 160 170 grams so you can barely feel that you've got them with you now when it comes to free hand holding binoculars i'm always a big fan of low magnifications and these only have eight times magnification so you might think that they're quite underwhelming. Well, in many ways you could be right, I suppose, but I consider these to be what I call detailed binoculars. And what I mean by that is that they don't so much show you more things than you can see and little tiny microscopic items a mile away. But what they do do is allow you to see things that you can already see, just big enough to see more detail on them. For example, just over there, there's a family of Canada geese and I can see that there's about five young and two parents but when I look through these I can easily see that the young have still got their nice fluffy furry feathers across their head and down their backs so they really do give you just a nice clear extra close look at the things around you another benefit to small binoculars is that they do very often have a very near focus point so you can focus them on things that are very close to you which makes them ideal for close up nature like this or even the birds on the beard table in your garden something to consider with smaller binoculars though is that because by their nature they have smaller objective lenses in this case 21 millimeters they do normally give you a darker image than you would with obviously a larger pair but for me personally when you're only spending about 10 pound on these maybe even less if you shop around you're still going to get an excellent value from any product. So, if you want to know more information and how much I've been enjoying using some small binoculars, make sure you check out the link in the description, and hopefully I'll see you again soon. Thanks very much. Goodbye.